Invisible yet relentless, the chronic illness known as systemic lupus erythematosus, or SLE, creates a battlefield within the body. Imagine a war waging within you, a conflict unseen to the naked eye, yet its effects are felt in every fiber of your being. This is the reality for those living with systemic lupus erythematosus, a chronic inflammatory condition that can affect various systems in the body. It's like a ghost, unseen, but its presence is deeply felt, its echoes reverberating through every day and night. SLE, as it is often abbreviated, can manifest in a myriad of ways, making it a chameleon of the medical world. The author of our story, like many others, experienced symptoms such as brain fog, fatigue, chills, swollen lymph nodes and dizziness. These signs, while seemingly disparate, are the body's way of signalling that something is amiss. Imagine the feeling of a foggy brain, where thoughts become as elusive as wisps of smoke. The fatigue so profound that it feels as though gravity has trebled its pull on you. The chills that cause you to shiver even in the warmth of noon. Swollen lymph nodes that serve as painful reminders of your body's ongoing struggle. And the dizziness that makes the world spin in a disorienting dance. These are not merely discomforts that can be brushed off with a good night's sleep. They are constant companions. Shadows that follow those with SLE around the clock, making every moment an uphill battle. It's a daily struggle, a tug of war between the desire to live a normal life and the reality of a body in constant turmoil. Yet, despite these visible signs, the diagnosis of lupus often remains elusive. It's like chasing a phantom, always just out of reach. This leads those suffering from it on a journey of uncertainty and frustration. A journey where the destination is not a place, but a name for their unseen struggle. And so, the fight continues silent but unyielding in the battlefield within. Despite these visible signs, the diagnosis of lupus often remains elusive, leading to a journey of uncertainty and frustration. The path to diagnosing lupus is often fraught with misdirection and misunderstanding. Imagine the onset of a chronic illness. You're in college, your life brimming with potential when you contract mononucleosis. It's a common enough ailment among students, but for you, it sets off a chain of events that leaves you grappling with prolonged fatigue, brain fog, chills, swollen lymph nodes, and dizziness. These symptoms are insidious, relentless, and seemingly inexplicable, making you feel like a stranger in your own body. You seek medical help, hoping for answers, only to find yourself in the midst of a labyrinth of misdiagnosis. Your symptoms are chalked up to depression, neuroticism and chronic fatigue syndrome. Each label feels like a dead end, a dismissal of your lived experience. The doctor's words echo in your mind, it's all in your head, this is not an isolated incident. It's a common narrative for those living with lupus, a systemic illness that causes inflammation throughout the body. The varied nature of lupus symptoms can lead to misdiagnosis, as it mimics many other conditions. It's a chameleon of diseases, its true nature often hidden beneath layers of confusion and misunderstanding. Misdiagnosis is more than just a medical error. It's a disservice to those seeking help, a reinforcement of the feeling of invisibility that accompanies chronic illness. When the medical system, often dismissive, fails to listen to understand, it can exacerbate the struggle, leaving individuals feeling unheard and misunderstood. The medical system, often dismissive, can leave those with lupus feeling unheard and misunderstood. When conventional medicine falls short, some turn to alternative paths in hope of relief. A sentiment echoed by countless individuals grappling with chronic illnesses, much like the author of our story, who after a series of misdiagnoses found themselves seeking solace in the realm of holistic medicine. Holistic medicine, with its focus on whole body wellness, offers a unique perspective on health. It's not about treating just the symptoms, it's about understanding the root cause, the underlying imbalances that trigger the disease. For those who have spent years battling an invisible enemy, this approach can seem like a breath of fresh air. However, holistic medicine is not without its challenges. It often requires significant lifestyle changes. It necessitates a level of self-discipline and commitment that can feel overwhelming, particularly when one is already worn down by the relentless onslaught of symptoms. And then there's the question of efficacy. While some find great relief in natural remedies and alternative therapies, for others, the benefits are less tangible. For our author, 
holistic medicine sadly fell into the latter category. Despite their efforts, the relief was marginal, the progress slow. But in the face of chronic illness, desperation becomes a constant companion. It drives individuals to leave no stone unturned in their search for relief. It fuels the exploration of every possible avenue, from acupuncture to yoga, from herbal supplements to dietary changes. It's a journey marked by trial and error, by hope and disappointment, by small victories and setbacks. Yet, it's important to remember that each person's journey is unique. What works for one may not work for another. There's no one-size-fits-all solution when it comes to health, particularly in the case of complex conditions like systemic lupus, erythematosus. Yet for many, the quest for a cure remains elusive, the relief fleeting. But it's this very quest, this relentless pursuit of wellness, that underscores the resilience of those living with chronic illness. It's a testament to their courage, to their determination to reclaim their health one day at a time. Sometimes the most potent medicine is the validation of one's suffering. Our journey through the labyrinth of chronic illness now brings us to a pivotal moment in the story. The author's encounter with a nurse practitioner marked a significant turning point in their quest for a diagnosis. The nurse practitioner did something that had been sorely missing in the author's medical journey up until this point. Validation. This medical professional listened to the author's symptoms, took them seriously and crucially validated their suffering. This validation wasn't just a simple acknowledgement, it was an empathetic recognition of the author's distress and a commitment to finding the root cause. The nurse practitioner then ordered an ANA test, a blood test used to detect autoimmune disorders. This marked a significant shift in the author's healthcare journey, one that steered towards a path of clarity and answers. So why is validation so essential in managing chronic illnesses? Firstly, it fosters a sense of being seen and heard, which can be incredibly empowering for patients navigating the healthcare system. Secondly, it encourages open communication, which is crucial in building a comprehensive understanding of the patient's condition. Thirdly, validation can lead to more accurate diagnoses and effective treatment plans, as it did in the author's case. Validation can also have profound psychological effects. It can alleviate feelings of isolation and helplessness, and it can engender hope. In the author's case, the validation from the nurse practitioner not only led to the correct diagnosis, but also provided a sense of relief and hope. Emotions that had been in short supply. The importance of validation cannot be overstated. It can be a lifeline for those struggling with chronic illness, a ray of light in what can often feel like a dark and confusing tunnel. It's a powerful reminder that patients are not alone, that their symptoms are real, and that their suffering is seen, heard and acknowledged. This moment of validation, often a hard one, can be a beacon of hope in the fog of chronic illness. The road to diagnosis is a journey, often long and winding, leading to more questions than answers. Such was the case for our author, whose story of navigating the healthcare system is a testament to the complexities and challenges in diagnosing systemic lupus erythematosus, commonly known as lupus. Lupus is a chronic disease that can cause inflammation throughout the body. It's a tricky condition to diagnose, as its symptoms often mimic those of other illnesses. In fact, there is no single definitive test for lupus, and it's often diagnosed through a process of elimination, making the road to diagnosis a particularly rocky one. Our author's journey took a turn when a nurse practitioner validated her symptoms and ordered an ANA test. ANA, or anti-nuclear antibody tests, are commonly used when lupus is suspected. The test came back positive, which was a significant step towards finding answers. The positive ANA test led to a referral to a rheumatologist, a specialist in rheumatic diseases including lupus. This marked a crucial milestone on the road to diagnosis. Rheumatologists have specialized training and experience in diagnosing and treating complex diseases like lupus, which can affect many different parts of the body. The process of diagnosing lupus often involves multiple appointments, various tests, and, unfortunately, a lot of waiting. It's a journey that requires patience, resilience, and a willingness to advocate for one's health. Yet the journey does not end with a definitive diagnosis. 
A diagnosis, while providing some clarity, is often just the beginning of a lifelong journey with lupus. For our author and many like her, the diagnosis of lupus was not a conclusion but the start of a new chapter in understanding and managing the disease. The road to diagnosis may be long and winding but it's a crucial path towards finding answers, understanding the condition and working towards managing life with lupus. Living with an invisible illness presents unique challenges, both physical and psychological. It's like being in a never-ending battle with an unseen enemy. Every day, the author wakes up to the reality of lupus, a chronic illness that causes inflammation throughout the body. Fatigue, chills, swollen lymph nodes, dizziness, these are the constant companions of those living with this disease. Yet to the outside world, everything appears normal. The pain and discomfort remain hidden behind a facade of wellness. This invisibility adds a mental toll to the physical one. The constant need to explain why you're not just tired, why you can't just push through, it's exhausting. It's a silent struggle that many don't understand and some refuse to acknowledge. The stigma around invisible illnesses, like lupus, is palpable. People are quick to dismiss what they can't see, making those suffering feel unseen and unheard. Invisible illnesses also bring a unique loneliness. You might be surrounded by people but still feel isolated because they can't truly understand what you're going through. You find yourself grappling with feelings of frustration, bitterness and even guilt for the burden you feel you've become. And yet, there's a resilience that emerges from living with an invisible illness. It's found in the small victories, like managing to complete a task despite the fatigue or having a good day amidst a week of bad ones. It's in the determination to not let the disease define you to keep pushing forward, even when every step is an uphill battle. Invisible illnesses like lupus may not leave visible marks, but they impact every aspect of a person's life. They affect the physical body, yes, but they also weigh heavily on the mind and spirit. The struggle is constant, but so too is the strength and resilience of those living with these conditions. Invisible it may be, but the impact of lupus is far from unseen. Awareness and understanding are crucial weapons in the battle against lupus. In a world where knowledge is at our fingertips, it is of utmost importance that we educate ourselves about conditions like lupus. This isn't just a disease that affects the body, it impacts the mind, the spirit and the daily lives of those who live with it. The first step towards understanding lupus is to acknowledge its invisibility. Lupus, like many chronic illnesses, often hides beneath the surface, unseen by the naked eye. Its symptoms may not be apparent, leading to a lack of recognition and misdiagnosis, further complicating the journey of those who live with it. It is here that awareness steps in as our first line of defense. By raising awareness about lupus, we can shed light on the unseen and bring it to the forefront. Awareness isn't just about spreading information, it's about sparking conversations, breaking down stigmas and creating a supportive community for those impacted by the condition. Promoting understanding among medical professionals is equally vital. Every lupus patient's journey is unique and their experiences and symptoms can vary widely. Recognizing this variability and being open to exploring beyond the textbook definitions can pave the way for more accurate diagnoses and effective treatment plans. But the responsibility of understanding doesn't rest solely on the shoulders of the healthcare community. It is incumbent upon all of us to foster compassion and empathy for those living with lupus. This understanding can help us support them better, whether it's by accommodating their needs, lending a listening ear, or simply acknowledging their struggles. Advocacy is the final piece of this puzzle. By advocating for those living with lupus, we can ensure they have the resources they need, from access to healthcare to emotional support. Advocacy also involves pushing for further research into this condition in the hopes of finding more effective treatments and ultimately a cure. Together, with awareness and understanding, we can stand in solidarity with those battling lupus. The story of lupus is a tale of resilience in the face of unseen adversity. We've journeyed through the winding maze of misdiagnosis, the relentless search for relief and the eventual powerful validation of one's experiences. The road to diagnosis for those with lupus is often fraught with challenges and yet they continue to persevere. 
Living with an invisible illness like lupus can be isolating, but it's the understanding and awareness from others that can make all the difference. We've learned that systemic lupus erythematosus is not just an illness of the body, but also a test of the spirit. The strength and resilience shown by those battling this condition are nothing short of inspiring. It's a reminder that even in the face of adversity, the human spirit remains unbroken. It's crucial that we continue to educate ourselves and others about lupus and similar invisible illnesses. Validation, awareness and understanding are powerful tools in the fight against these conditions. Remember, your sharing of this video could make a difference in someone's life. Stand with those living with lupus, share their stories, share their strength.